If you're going to get scared this Halloween, if you're brave enough, then you should check out the Warner Robins Police Department's haunted house at the old jail. 41 NBC's Amanda Castro joins us live with more on how your screams are going toward a good cause. Spooky sights, creepy sounds, and terrifying terrors. That's what you can expect here at the Haunted House put on by the Warner Robins Police Department. I'm joined by Jennifer Parson, who is going to give us a little peek, a little preview of what we can expect. So thanks for joining us tonight, Jennifer. Absolutely. So this is the second time the police department's put on a haunted house, but you guys are doing it bigger and better and scarier this year, right? Right. This is the second time we've done it in this building. A couple of years ago, we used to do it down by the firing range, if you remember, um, but we're actually using the old jail. And uh, yes, this is the second time that we've done it. This time we're tapping in to all senses. So you'll go in, you'll smell things, you'll hear things, you'll feel things. Um, not necessarily our actors touching you now, but you'll feel the temperature change and we're tapping into all those senses. And what I think is awesome about this uh, haunted house that you guys are doing is that you're Putting the all the money that you raise is benefiting a, a good cause. All those screams, if you will, are collecting and benefiting for a good cause. So, what organization are you guys helping out this year? We're helping out the Joanna McAfee um, Childhood Cancer Foundation. All the money that we raise here, it's ten dollars to get in. Every month, penny that you give us will go to that foundation. And that's a local family. It's a Warner it Robins is. family. It is. Um, Miss McAfee is actually a teacher in Houston County, and, and she'll be coming, and so will her husband from time to time as well. Awesome. So give us the details, the dates, the time, the when, the where, the why. Absolutely. So we open our doors tomorrow and we'll be open from 7 to 11, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday of this week, and Thursday, Friday, and Saturday of next week, closing out on Halloween night. Awesome. It's got, I mean, just the outside. If you guys can see, we'll just kind of step away. There's like, it's just scary. This is going to be all light up. It's going to be super scary inside. So it's a lot of fun, yeah. a lot of fun times. Thank you so much, Jennifer, for joining us. I'll have more tonight on 41 NBC News at 11. Reporting live in Warner Robins, Amanda Castro, 41 NBC News. Perfect for Halloween. The Warner Robins Police Department Haunted House starts tomorrow and runs through Saturday from 7 to 11 at night at the old police station on Young Avenue. Tickets are $10, and as you heard Amanda say, the money's raised to benefit the Joanna McAfee Childhood Cancer Foundation. The Haunted House is also going on next week as well.